In this screencast, we'll uh, discuss some of the basics of zone matching and optical character recognition. So um, let's start with um, image zones. Um, zone matching is a technique used in uh, computer vision for image matching. And uh, so ba the basic idea is that um, uh, an image is divided into several uh, sub-images um, called uh, zones. And uh, in each zone, a specific statistic is uh, computed. So for example, that statistic uh, can be the number of horizontal lines or the number of pixels of a specific color. So for example, if uh, we're interested in counting um, uh, uh, the number of pixels of black color, so let's imagine that we've divided um, our image into uh, four zones. And um, uh, so these are the uh, black uh, pixels. Uh, in this zone, we will have um, uh, five uh, uh, black pixels. So this is the first zone. Uh, this is the second zone. Uh, the number is arbitrary. Uh, this is the third zone. Uh, and uh, this is the fourth zone. So once we have um, a divided image into uh, sub-images or uh, zones, we can compute the zone vector. So in Python notation, it's just a sequence of uh, numbers, each of which corresponds to the output of the statistics. So if we're counting the pixels, black pixels. So the first zone has two black pixels. The second has uh, three black pixels. The uh, third zone has um, uh, four. And uh, the fourth zone has uh, five. So this is uh, our zone vector that corresponds to that image. So um, let's um, uh, consider an example. So suppose that uh, we have, uh, on the pixel level, we have uh, the image of, uh, uh, with the character A. Right, so this is the left leg of the character. And then uh, the rest of the character, I'm going to sk skip a couple of frames, looks like, uh, looks like this. Right. So we can divide uh, this uh, image into uh, zones. So let's divide it into uh, nine zones. Right. Three on top, three in the middle, and um, three uh, on the bottom. One, two, three. The, the number of zones com is completely dependent on uh, the application and the performance required. Right. So these are our nine zones. And uh, we can convert uh, this into our zone vector, where uh, uh, the first element is the count of black pixels uh, in zone 1, then the count of black pixels in z uh, zone uh, 2, 3, and uh, so forth. Whatever that uh, uh, count is. So, so this is a nine element uh, zone vector. Now once uh, we have zone vectors, uh, so then the question becomes, well, how do we match them, right? How do we compute um, uh, their similarity, the similarity, how similar two zone vectors are. So uh, logically speaking, this is what we're doing. We have uh, two images, um, and then each image is converted into a zone vector. So let's say a, a zone vector 1 and uh, a zone vector 2. So let's say images of two characters, A and B, although they don't have to be characters. Uh, they can be anything. Okay, and then uh, the question uh, becomes, all right, how do we determine how similar uh, the two uh, zone vectors are? Right. And uh, one of the mm, uh, common uh, functions uh, that can be used is the cosine, right? So let's say that A, B are two vectors. So the cosine um, of A and B is uh, the dot product of A and B divided by uh, the product of the uh, two vector magnitudes. So uh, the actual mathematical formula is uh, the sum from um, uh, 1 uh, to n uh, of the uh, products of the individual elements right, of the two vectors. And then the, uh, in the numerator, in the, in the denominator, uh, we will have two uh, radicals. So the magnitude of uh, a vector um, uh, a. That's the square root of the sum of the squares of individual elements in A, and the um, 
the same as the square root of the sum of the squares of the individual uh, elements in uh, B. Yeah, so those are two uh, vector uh, magnitudes. Right. And um, so in Python, um, this is what uh, it may look like, right? one possible implementation in Python. And in, in general, cosine of uh, uh, two vectors right, uh, returns a number in the range from minus 1 to 1, which is the complete similarity, and this is the exact oppositeness with all uh, the numbers in between. Um, so, for example, if we call cosine similarity <coughs> in a Python shell, um, let's say on uh, two vectors, right, uh, zone vector 1 and zone vector 2, this is uh, vectors A and B in the above formula. Uh, let's suppose that if um, a zone vector is assigned uh, the value of 1, 2, and zone vector 2 is assigned the value of also 1, 2, then their cosine similarity will be 1. Or sometimes Python will give you 0.99999. And if uh, zone vector 2 is the minus 1, uh, zone vector 1, uh, it's going to be minus 1, the cosine similarity. So that's the exact opposite. So um, let's um, consider an example of zone vector matches in uh, um, how zone vectors can be used in optical character recognition. So let's suppose in this uh, project we will be dealing with um, uh, character images, uh, bitmaps of uh, 20 by 20 pixels in two different fonts, Courier and um, Helvetica. And the links will be uh, provided below the screencast that you can download uh, um, uh, to archives with these images. So, and each uh, bitmap uh, will be uh, divided, each image, into 16 5x5 five five, uh, pixel zones. Right? So the first one goes from 0, 0 on top left to 4, 4 on bottom right. And then the second uh, zone is from 5, 0 on top left to uh, 9, 4 on bottom right, and, and, and so forth. So each zone can be represented as a four-tuple of um, uh, integers. Right? The first one, the first two are top left, and the second uh, two uh, uh, bottom right. So zero zero four four. The second zone is five zero uh, to nine four uh, in the bottom right, and then the third zone is ten zero to fourteen four, and and so forth. Um, okay. So um, uh, this is the first uh, function uh, that we will implement in this uh, project, and that's uh, a zone um, a zone vector, right? So let's say that we have defined uh, zone coordinates as this variable uh, that encodes uh, 16 zones. Then um, uh, the zone vector function um, that um, we will implement uh, takes an image path, right? A path to a uh, 20 by 20 uh, bitmap, um, uh, black and white uh, bitmap of, uh, uh, with, with a character in a particular uh, font. Uh, so let's say I have it in my machine, um, uh, say, for example, in um, uh, letter images courier are 18 uh, a.bmp and then the second argument is uh, zone chords right and uh, it will compute the uh, zone vector right um, a, a, a 16 zone vector uh, of this image so right, this is the image and uh, then uh, that's uh, that was the uh, zone vector so the second function uh, that we will implement is build zone vector map that builds uh, the zone vector uh, dictionary mapping each character to its zone vector, um, each character image in a specific directory. So for example, uh, we can uh, say build zone vector map of um, all the characters in uh, uh, this uh, directory. Um, so uh, letter images courier R18. Okay, and uh, zvmap is a dictionary where every character is mapped to its zone vector. Okay, so a is mapped to uh, this uh, zone vector. Uh, the next the next function that we will implement is find best uh, zone vector character match. Um, so let's um, define um, a couple of things before mm, I'll show you uh, what that uh, function is like. Um, so uh, this is a zone vector for character A, uh, courier, and uh, let's compute the courier ZV map, uh, right? We've actually already computed it. So then find best um, uh, ZV character match 
uh, takes a uh, character, uh, sorry, uh, a, um, uh, a zone vector for a character and a map. Um, right? And it matches that zone vector to all of the zone vectors in the map um, with a specific similarity function that defaults to cosine similarity and returns the best match. So in this case, um, uh, so let's call it, so yeah, the best match is A. Right, then the match is 1, 0, so which is to be expected because it's the character um, uh, of the same font. Uh, now let's uh, compute um, the, uh, uh, the zone vector map for the Helvetica uh, uh, characters. So let me cut and paste uh, this call, save myself some typing. So this is the directory where I have uh, uh, saved Helvetica uh, images. And these are pill font uh, 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 images. And now we can have, um, okay, let's call uh, find this ZV ma uh, character match again. Um, and uh, let's see what, okay, so this is, we're going to uh, uh, match um, uh, the courier character against the Helvetica uh, zone vector. So it's still A, but um, uh, the similarity is not 1, but it's still pretty high. Okay. So this is the similarity. Uh, that's it's not the one because because of the difference, uh, the font differences. And uh, finally, uh, we will implement uh, find all ZV uh, character matches. It is similar uh, to uh, find best uh, ZV character match, uh, but uh, it will return uh, the sorted uh, list of matches of all the matches from smallest to fr from largest closest to uh, to smallest. So. Uh, let's say uh, we have, um, mm, okay, uh, this is our zone vector, Helvetica zone vector for character B. Uh, and um, we're going to uh, uh, try to find all ZV uh, character matches for uh, ZV uh, Helvetica uh, R18 uh, map. This is, uh, okay, so for the zone vector of Helvetica R18 uh, A, character A, uh, in the zone vector of the courier uh, characters. So, okay, uh, so that's a, uh, that's good. So we are, um, um, uh, we're good.